Hello, my name is Rohan Shodriya and I am an RF Applications Engineer at MiniCircuits. In this video, I'll be talking about reflectionless filters and their use cases. It is well known that SNR and dynamic range are very important in signal change. This is especially true for ADCs, radars, transceivers and sensing applications. And the way to enhance the performance of such signal chains is to reduce harmonics and spurious content. This is commonly done using the out-of-band reflective property of filters. Reflective filters are intentionally designed to have poor impedance match in stop bands. This causes the undesired reflected signals, including harmonics match in stop bands, noise to reflect back into the signal chain. The result is a standing wave in the chain, which in turn may cause gain compression, oscillations and decreased stability. By definition, reflectionless filters provide good matching in both passband and stopband. They are designed to absorb the unwanted signals rather than reflect them back into the chain. They can eliminate standing waves without the use of attenuation pads. One such example, which is very common in real world, is a multiplier chain. In this specific case, the goal is to stabilize conversion efficiency over frequency. It was observed that using reflective filters in multiplier chains causes an undesired effect where out-of-band harmonics are reflected back into the multiplier. This leads to the multiplier showing ripples in conversion loss and becomes susceptible to external factors. This is more noticeable the longer this multiplier chain gets. We experimented with some reflectionless filters in the multiplier chains and found out that absorbing the out-of-band harmonics leads to improvement in conversion efficiency of the multiplier. The results show this comparison with different input power levels and different electrical lengths between a multiplier and a filter. We already see ripples in conversion loss even without significant length of adapter or cable between the multiplier and filter. In longer multiplier chains, the reflective nature of conventional filters can degrade the conversion loss flatness and it may ultimately end up increasing the complexity of the system. In comparison, a well-known combination of multiplier with reflectionless filter can achieve better conversion loss efficiency while minimizing cost. For more detailed information, of this experiment and similar use cases of reflectionless filters, please take a look at our white paper on this topic. Thanks and see you next time.